show's about a guy called Richard who chooses to live in his imagination as the 10 year old boy he was in primary school back in the 1970s. And the reason he does this is because he's living with dementia and he wants to cling on to those long term memories as long as he possibly can. Um, and those memories um, occur to him when he hears a familiar piece of music, a familiar song. And so he builds a soundtrack for his life. So effectively, this is a show about dementia, dignity and, and joy in the most distressing of circumstances and time travel and smurfs. So it's a, a play about a very serious subject, but with an awful lot of heart and soul and power and joy to it. So there's a bubble, cups in my hands. I hold it up to the light, I see it shine, and beyond it there's you, by the apple tree, smiling at me. And I know that all I want to do is show you the bubble because it's beautiful, and I'd like to offer you beautiful things. And it's you, and I now, you and I, and that bubble in the whole universe when all else has faded to black. The illness is, is ever present uh, in the show. You don't see it. It's not physicalised in any way, but it's, it's a looming presence. And, and Richard talks to the illness several times during the show. Um, and it's a, it's a conflict between him desperately trying to preserve um, his memories as a 10 year old boy uh, in the 1970s and the illness which is encroaching uh, upon him in a very gradual way throughout the show. Um, and I think Richard ultimately knows it's a battle that he can't win but he is determined to take the fight to the illness uh, and combat uh, to the very last. Um, and so it's about defiance and it's about courage. I'm the man you laughed with, cried with, fought with, made up with, danced with, dreamed with. You're the girl, the woman I lived for. You are everything I remember. Dementia is a devastating and cruel disease um, and in portraying the part of, of a person with dementia um, it's necessary to handle that with the sensitivity and the respect that is due. I've attempted to do that there are going to be some incredibly challenging scenes in the show uh, they'll be difficult to watch they're certainly difficult enough to perform um, and I just want to make sure that I, I, I do uh, I do the subject justice and I handle it in the right way.